Hello and welcome everyone. Today we're going to take a look at an AI that generates crossword puzzles. Explicitly, we'll be giving our AI a structure or a grid and a list of words and the AI will find the words that best match the crossword puzzle uh, specifications. And the way to do this is by thinking about a crossword puzzle in a constraint satisfaction type of problem where our unary constraint is the length of each square sequence which we'll call a variable. So, in all of those, all of the words that we have in our file will be all the possible domains for each variable, correct? And now we'll remove all of those words from the domain that does not match the length of the word itself. And then our binary constraint is finding the word that will have a corresponding word in the overlapping square sequence that have the same letter. And you, from there, we're going to use backtra backtracking in order to find a solution, hopefully. And obviously to speed up the process when selecting an unassigned variable we're going to use the MRV heuristic and if we get a tie or the minimum uh, remaining value heuristic and if we get a tie we're going to pick the one with the highest degrees and likewise when ordering the domains to pick from we're going to pick the one that gives the other uh, variables the least constraints effectively speeding up the process now Right here in my folder, inside data, we have a bunch of structures and a bunch of words that we're going to run our code on. And in my logic.json, I'm going to pass in, let's start with passing a structure.0 and words.0, which is the simplest of them. Let's jump into the generate.py and run it. As you can see, immediately as soon as it runs, it will find the best word. And likewise, the output.png is generated for us so we can have a visual representation. And if we take a look at words of zero here, we'll see that we just have one through ten. And the program file did locate the best one of them. And likewise, likewise, if we do structure but on words of one and run it you see that it fits them right in did all of that and let's try a new structure this time structure of one and run it structure of one is slightly bigger but should also be quick to compute as soon as the thing starts yep the intelligence minimax all of that and again can see a visual representation of this right over here and let's try words of two on the first structure and yep works just fine and lastly let's do structure two with words of two and run that And in case you're wondering, from the moment of execution, this took exactly 1.5 seconds. So that's all for the video. As you can see, this can be really helpful when creating crossword puzzles because you can just give the system the structure you want and the list of words and it tells you what the better combinations or the possible combinations so that you can then formulate your own crossword grid puzzle easily. Thank you all for watching and have a nice day.